Why ISIS came to us and why it killed us? Why? It's because we are Yazidi. Most of people in the whole world don't know about us. 600,000 Yazidis without rights, without voice. I escaped from 74 genocides. The last genocide it was August 2014. Just because we are like a small religion, we believe our religion. That's happened to us. The ISIS came to our, our villages and our towns. They killed all the men right away together. And they took all the women and girls and kids to, to join them to the, to the other religion. Even they like, they teach them English and Arabic just to, to make them to forget their rules, their religion, their language. We don't hate anyone. When we pray, we pray for everyone, then we pray for ourselves. Most of the families, they went to Mount. Because there is no other choice. And in mountains, there is no water, there is no food. So what are you gonna do? 75 of the whole world, it's water. And yeah, our community died because of war. That I can I can't imagine that. After we got chance, we skipped to Kurdistan, but it was still like we were nervous, we were like scared because we don't know what's going on around us. My family in Kurdistan, they got visa. They came to Turkey. We were refugees in Turkey, like about three years. We heard about Operation Ezra and they were like, we are excited to help. So I made this family and your family is one of them. They gave it to them, everything, their loves, their help. Their, their homes, like everything. 74 genocides, and we still survive. We still have a hope. We still have a goals. We still have, have a future. We're looking for a good future. We're still smiling. We still love all the people around us. We're still hoping for no war in the world again. No, no killing each other, no hitting each other. We are who needs help always. So if I got a chance, I'm, I wanted to help people, always.